so today is going to be a lip swatch video. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of the Glow Minerals Suede Matte Crayons. So I'm going to be swatching all of these on my skin and on my lips, and we're just going to be talking about the formula and stuff. I haven't even opened any of these yet, so this is going to be new for all of us. So this is what the first one is. This one is in Crush. Let's see. We're just jumping right in. Oh, so there's a sharpener like in the end. I, I was wondering why there's like a two-part cap system. All right, and then the actual, no, no. Am I dumb? Okay. <laughs> and then the actual thing is like under the whole entire cap. So this is a red color. Let's see. These feel really, really creamy. So that is that one. Let's put it on my lips. Let's see. I like these crayons because they're usually easier to put on. That's really pretty. You smell slightly minty, maybe. So that is this one. What did I say? Crush. So it's just like a nice, like, pretty standard red, I would say. I like it. I'm not huge, huge into reds, unless it's like an orangey red, but I like this. And it doesn't feel like too, too drying. I should not be wearing right, right, white right now. What am I thinking? So I'm going to take this one off, then we'll try the next one. All right, this next one is in Demure, and it's like a mauve -y looking color maybe? Let's see. Yeah, it seems like a really pretty kind of mauve color. Let's try it. I feel like that red one left a little bit of a stain. I should have ordered these like light to dark, but I didn't do that. This one seems even smoother than the red one, but maybe not quite as pigmented, or it's because I just used makeup remover on my lips. I don't know. That's a really pretty color though. They look so really, really pretty for like an everyday kind of thing in the spring. Not the spring, the fall. But yeah, I really like this one. Demure. Next we have Sherbert or Sorbet, I guess. My bad. This looks like more of like a purpley kind of, yeah, that's actually way brighter than I was expecting. But that's really pretty. I feel like I'm doing a very good job swatching. Normally I'm terrible at swatching, but I'm sure I just drink myself. Let's see. This one's... A very full color. <gasps> no. That one's really, really pretty. This is nice for like the summertime and stuff because it's like bright, but it's not like crazy bright. I'm a fan. I really like the formula of these though. They're nice and soft. And they do have the sharpener in the cap, even though they're not a twist up, but that's fine. We have a trademark, which looks like it's going to be a really pretty kind of like neutral nude color. Yeah, yeah. That looks nice. Let's see, my lips are getting, getting there. This is like, essentially my lip color right now. That, or it's not as pigmented, I don't know. Like this is like slightly darker than my natural lip color, but since my natural lips are stained right now, it just looks like my lip color. But this is like a very, very pretty everyday kind of color, especially to give you like that matte look. And there has to be mint or something in these because my lips are starting to burn from wiping them off and then putting this stuff right back on. I don't think it says or anything. They are cruelty free, which is good. Yeah, peppermint oil. That's what's doing it. All right, we have another red. This one is in Bombshell. I don't know what to expect right now. So this is more like a blue toned red than the first one. The first one was a little more orange. Yeah, I would say this is more of like a true red. I really, really like this one. Like I said, I'm not a huge, huge red person, but this is a very nice like blue. I don't know why I'm doing this because the tube isn't that colored, but old habits die hard. I really like this red. All right, now we have Monogram. It looks like another nude color. This one, very similar to this one. Maybe slightly more beige and this one's slightly more pink. Let's see. I think it's a little more beige, yeah. But again, over my stained lips, this is totally my bad. I should have like planned this better. I still really, I like this color. I don't, mm, what, I feel like they're so similar. Like you wouldn't need both. Just depends if you like slightly more 
beige kind of color or a more pink color, but this is really pretty. I really like these kinds of colors. All right, and last but not least, it looks like a darker red. This is in crimson. Ooh. So I'm assuming, you know, this is more of like a darker berry red. It's obviously the darkest one we've tried so far, so at least we didn't try this one like first. This is gonna be really pretty for like winter, I think. Do you see how I'm applying this right now? This is why people shouldn't let me do swatch videos. <laughs> okay, well. You get the gist of the color. This is super pretty. I'm really liking this. It's like a nice dark red without being too brown and without being too berry. Mm, I'm a fan of this one. I didn't think I would like it at first. I was like, okay, a dark red, but I really actually like this one, especially for the fall coming up. And it's not coming up. Don't say that, but you know what I mean. Okay, so I just put monogram back on. I think this one might be my favorite. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My nose itches, I'm sorry. And I don't know, if you guys like swatch videos like this from different brands and stuff, I feel like everyone has done like the NYX li Lix lingerie. <laughs> NYX liquid what are they called? You know what I'm talking about. But like different things that I don't see a ton. You guys like these? Let me know. I was sent these for the purpose of doing a swatch video. Did I say that already? I don't know. But that, that happened. So yeah. Let me know if you guys like this. I will post links and stuff below. I have to take my thumbnail now. I'm trying so hard not to ruin this. But yes, I will see you guys in my next video. And seriously, thanks for watching. I feel like you guys have been going above and beyond with views lately. So I feel like I have a lot new, not a lot, a lot new, okay. I have a lot of new viewers. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not subscribed already, I don't usually say this, but please subscribe, stick around. I do lots of fun stuff, hopefully. But yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Thank you.